If you're still making plans for the holiday weekend, you can check out the longest continuously running parade west of the Mississippi, the 70, 171st annual Round Top 4th of July Parade is Sunday. Tara Newbaum is live in Round Top with details. Tara, 171 years. Wow, what a history. I. I know, Leslie, can you believe that? How incredible and what a historic event to be a part of. So Dave, when people want to come out and join in on, on the festivities here for the 4th of July, what do they need to know? Basically, the parade begins at 10.30. Uh, it's actually the shooting of the cannon here that we have uh, signifies the start of the parade. Uh, it'll begin uh, at the hall, rifle hall, just as about half a mile on 1457. And then we'll meander through town, around the square, and then go back to the hall. And uh, just, you know, it's usually a large, it's always a large parade. We have over 100 entries uh, from decorated floats to patriotic entries, as well as antique, classic cars, tractors, the whole nine yards. Uh, it's a great family event. And uh, just uh, a, a reminder uh, is to be here a little early. Come here a little early. How does somebody win the best float? What are you guys looking for? Well, we have some good judges for that. Uh, we have about nine different categories, and uh, it takes them a while. They, uh, they're out there on their ATVs looking around, comparing notes and, and so forth. And uh, uh, yeah, it just depends what category, but uh, we have a lot of good ones, and uh, we're, uh, we're, you know, it's pretty amazing. We talk about how historic this parade is, 171 years, and for somebody who's not experienced it before, you know, why would you invite them to, to be part of something like this? It's just one of a kind. Uh, again, we stress it's a family event where, you know, the, most of the entries are throwing out candy and all types of goodies, and, and so the kids usually have their bags full by the end of the parade, and uh, uh, again, we have good food and fellowship activities at the Rifle Hall, barbecue meal, the whole nine yards. Uh, so, yeah, it's just a, it's a one of a kind and it's got to be here. See it to believe it. Absolutely. How cool is that? And we have one of the very many parade floats that are going to be out here this weekend. And if you can hear the music playing in the background right now, that's the brass band. Uh, they are celebrating 50 years and we'll get a little bit more information on that next hour. But right now, Tom, how long did it take you guys to build this masterpiece? Oh, we started in the 1st of May and uh, finished up last night, putting final, final touches on it. What's it like to be part of the parade down here in Round Top? It's an absolute blast. The crowd is very enthusiastic. And Snoopy's up there being a pilot. We, uh, we'll have eight people on, on a float, all undressed in costumes. All the characters will be here. We'll be throwing candy to the kids and beads to everybody. But it's just a real fun family parade. And like we mentioned, you know, I asked Dave over there, but for somebody who's not experienced this, like, what has it been like for you to be part of this throughout the years? It's an absolute blast. I mean, we've built five of these things so far over the years, and uh, we've had a, a, a blast doing it, and people really enjoyed it. So, and you can see the smile on their faces. Everybody points and takes pictures of you. <laughs> when you see something built like this, it's a lot of fun. Parade starts at 1030 on Sunday. Good luck, you guys. I know you've gotten first place a couple times before, uh, but you want to make sure to plan your trip accordingly. Get out here to Round Top with plenty of time because they're telling me that, you know, the roads are going to be backed up, maybe even shut down in a couple of places. So when the cannon goes off at 1030, you want to make sure that you have a spot to enjoy the historic parade right here in Round Top. Leslie, back to you. All right, Tara Newbaum reporting for us in Round Top. Thanks, Tara.